Good morning, darlings. Let's get to some really great skin prep so we have a great face day, shall we? So in the hair, I have honey and a little bit of jojoba. I'm gonna add in my pink sea salt because of my mermaid heart. And then I'm gonna add a little bit of lemon because vitamin C lighten, tightens, and brightens, y'all. And honestly, why are you gonna keep putting makeup on all your dead skin? I mean, if you haven't exfoliated in the last week, the chance is that you are exfoliating your dead, I mean, <laughs> putting makeup on your dead skin, of course it's not gonna sit properly. Of course it's gonna fade halfway throughout the day. Of course it's going to look like you just kind of rolled out of bed in the morning, even though you've been up since six o'clock trying to get your day started. So this is just a nice light coat. Punch it up towards your under eye. It's safe for your eyes. Just don't get it inside. And just lightly coat your whole face. Jehovah, I swear, this should be like the new age skincare. If your skincare doesn't have Jehovah in it, you need it. Like it helps plump up those fine lines. It helps stop those crow's, we crow's feet from forming. I don't know. My skin has never looked this good. And this is 42. And this is ingredients for my pantry. And I love the skin that I am in. Because I take care of it. I pamper myself, babies. You need to too. So here we go. Let's set this for 15 minutes. And then I'll show you a perfectly faced face right for the <laughs> ready for the day ready to conquer your mood and whatever is going to be thrown at you trust me if you feel great if your skin feels great if you're just feeling extra bougie va va look at what i know my nails are awesome right and no leftovers that's how you know you're doing stuff right anyways boobs, i'll see you in a minute <laughs> Don't forget to do a light little rub and exfoliant just to help break away any of those binds that might be holding onto something you just wanna get rid of. <laughs> See darlings, there we are, flawless skin. But you need to start with a good base or like I told you, you're just kinda putting your makeup on top of dead skin. Of course it's not gonna look right. Thank you for watching. We'll see you tomorrow.